वेलकम बैक इन टूडे सेशन आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू व्हाट एग्जैक्टली द यूज ऑफ द ट्रांजैक्शन एम ए एस एस मास एक्चुअली द मास ट्रांजैक्शन इज यूज्ड टू चेंज द वैल्यूज एट वंस इफ वी हैव 100 नंबर ऑफ कस्टमर्स और 1000 नंबर ऑफ कस्टमर्स एंड इफ वी वुड लाइक टू चेंज द फील्ड वैल्यू of multiple customers at a same time then we will use the transaction mask so okay. here let me say let me take some data <coughs> let me go through the transaction k and a1 and let me take some customers based around the country india okay so here let me remove all of them and here and let me take nelson id also see <clears throat> if we see here these are all the customers right 77777778 and these are all the customers so medibody medico something something mm. like. so we have created all these customers and the nelson id of these customers is m1 for most of them it's m1 and for mm. this customer and this customer and this customer and this customer and for the customer rajit we don't have the mm. nelson id mm. <coughs> so okay. if we get a requirement that to change or that to yeah that to change the nelson mm. id of all the customers as m2 mm. so okay. what we are doing till now we are going to the customer master change mode of the customer master and we are mm. changing the values there okay right that's what we are doing yeah. till now uh. so what we can do with this transaction is we can change the values we can change the multiple values at the same time okay so let me tell you that before that let me take <clears throat> the customers here okay let me take the customer numbers i am just using excel uh, okay or else let me take one notepad see these are all the customers okay Okay. For which the Nelson IDs are here, the M1, and here it is M1. So like this. So here the requirement is to make the Nelson IDs of these customers as M2. So let me go to <coughs> let me go through the transaction M A S S C. This one M A S S mark. Okay. Here. The object name is K N A one customers because we are changing the values of the customers, right? Mm. And we have to execute. Mm. After we execute, we will get the screen like this. Okay. Mm. Then you have to select the K N A one table because you are you can find the values in K N A one, right? See. Here the uh, values are there in K and A one. Okay. So here I have given K and A one because in the K and A one table only we can find the Nelson ID. Okay. So let me check this one and let me go to the fields here. Here the Nelson ID, right? So, so here, yeah, this one, Nelson ID. So let me check this one and let me execute. So here I have to press enter. So here it is asking us the customers, right? Mm -hmm. So already we have copied some customers. So let me give the customers here. So let me execute now. So if we execute here.
see we will get the screen like this see here we can find the nelson id right the m1 is the nelson id for all of these customers and for some customers the nelson id is blank right so what we have to do now we have to change this value as m2 right so what i am giving here is the new value should be m2 so here i am giving m2 and i am just pressing enter then see here carry out a mouse change there is an option that carry out a mouse change so we have to click on this one so have you seen have you observed what was happening here everything changed all yes the, the nelson id of all these customers got changed mm. okay. so we have to save now mm. okay then we have to click on yes see for all these customers the values got changed so if you want you can check them here in the transaction mm. x302 are x three zero three, or else you can check here in the table also, right? Mm. So let me see if I execute the table here, the values got changed. Okay. Okay. And if we open the transaction x three zero three, here also we can get the value as. M two right? What the Nelson ID for the field value in Nelson ID? And let me go through the customer sales area. And if we go through the marketing, here the Nelson ID is M two. Okay. So in this way, we can make the changes to any of the fields. We can do the mass carry out. For the field values, mm. either in sales documents, or in the customer master, or in the vendor master, or in the material master, or to the conditions, whatever it may be. Mm. So I think you are clear with the transaction MASS MASS, right? Okay. Okay. And if you have any queries, you yes. can make the comment in the comment section. <clears throat> Hope you are clear. I'm concluding the session for now.